even someone like me that has been running a clothing brand for a while we can make mistakes and end up in a position where we can't actually fund the next collection and that is when pre-orders come in that's when pre-orders enter the chat for those of you that don't know me my name is teddy g and on this channel i share what it's truly like to run a clothing brand as well as drop in tips tricks gems and all of that good stuff let's set up a pre-order campaign for a couple of new t-shirts that i am thinking of launching this autumn i have created quite a few pre-order videos on my youtube channel that's because i want to launch my blank brand right and i did want to launch it with pre-orders i was thinking actually i could probably launch a new collection for she washable with pre-orders as well so that's exactly what i'm going to show you how i am going to put that together as a pre-order launch campaign and show you what that looks like on the shopify app so we're actually going to jump into my laptop and we're going to look into exactly how we're going to do that to be honest i'm still not 100 confident whether or not i actually want to launch these t-shirts but let's see how it works i feel like this is going to be quite an interesting little series i just want to mention i'm so happy to be working with the early bird pre-order and restock app for this video and as you can see we are in the back end of my shopify store and we are gonna set up a pre-order launch campaign for these brand new t-shirts that i don't even have a name for yet so the first thing we're gonna do is actually hop into canva and these are the t-shirt mock-ups that i've created using canva to use as part of my pre-order launch campaign and they match the aesthetic of the flat that I have on my website already so I'm just going to go ahead and download those in jpeg and in a good high quality I am now back in my shopify app and I'm going to go over here where it says products and I'm going to add two new products we're going to call the first one shava t-shirt accru and for the description I'm just pasting a description from one of my previous t-shirts I'm going to leave it like this for the purposes of this video so i'm now adding the images of the t-shirt and the price is going to come in at 60 pound down here i'm going to add the variants which are going to be size so we're going to have small medium large and extra large they've changed this and made this even more complicated to add a product and done and then now i'm going to add the quantities so i'm just going to add 20 30 30 and then 20 and then we're going to save this product now we're going to click over here into app and we're going to click the early bird pre-order and restock app and i'm going to click down here where it says pre-orders and i'm going to click create campaign i'm going to call this campaign shower which is the name of the t-shirt and then where it says availability i'm going to click here where it says only sell pre-orders whilst they are in stock for stock limit, I'm going to keep, I will manually manage stock levels clicked and then for continue selling when out of stock i'm going to click this option here that says early bird should automatically manage this now for my campaign duration i would want it to start today midday 12 pm and the products i will want are of course the new product that i've just added which is shava and i'm going to select all of the variants i can also set an end date so i'm going to set this pre-order for one month and it will end at 12 a.m now scrolling down i would want my customers to be able to pay for this in full but if you want your customers can actually just pay a deposit and then pay the rest later you can also like decide if you want to add like a discount for example so you can say pre-order now and get 10 percent off then I'll apply a discount, it's going to be a percentage and I'm going to call it 10% now over here we want to put in the fulfillment date so this will be the date that you're going to be able to actually start sending out these orders to your customers so i'm going to select a specific <laughs> i can't talk i am going to select a specific fulfillment day and that's going to be in october probably the 2nd of october and the fulfillment time will probably be around about one o'clock in the afternoon and we're going to keep that as this 
and once that's all well and good we can click save and that campaign has now been created and here is where you'll be able to like manage and see whether or not people have ordered anything so up here I'm going to click publish campaign and currently it is processing the campaign and that takes up to one minute so I'm going to have a little chit chat with you guys a couple more features I wanted to touch on when it comes to this app is the back in stock email sign up feature if you know anything about me is that I love a little bit of email marketing so to be able to capture emails with potential customers being interested in items coming back in stock is just another way we can get the ball rolling when it comes to email marketing expanding on that customers also have the option to sign up for notifications for a product or specific variants so say if they wanted to order the small but the small is not in stock they can sign up to actually get a notification for when the small comes back into stock and they can also opt into your marketing newsletters now on the back end there's also a mini funnel which allows you to see who signed up who's received an email who's opened the email and who has actually made a purchase of your sold out product now i do have a code for this app and it's tidy g i'm gonna have it on the screen but yeah the main reasons why one would actually launch a pre-order launch campaign would be to build anticipation to build that initial like cash flow especially if your cash flow is a little bit limited it also reduces inventory risk so you're not ordering stock that's essentially not going to sell so for example when it comes to shavua shavua i would say the stock that doesn't actually sell funnily enough and hurtly enough is actually our tracksuit bottoms and i've got a feeling that i know the reason why and if you want me to do a video on my top performing products and my not so top performing performing products and the reasons why I think then please let me know in the comments and I will definitely film that video for you guys so we've jumped back into my screen and the campaign should be live so if I hop over here onto my website and I go over to all and I scroll and I scroll I should be able to find my brand new product here and as you can see it's got that beautiful pre-order tag right there I do need to adjust the way this is on my website I think I got the the image size wrong I don't know how I managed to do that but if I click onto my product you can pre-order the t-shirt that looks really good guys I'm quite happy with that and you can click here add to pre-order cart that little message has come up to say you will get 10% off so that will be the price and you can click pre-order and you'll be able to check out down here obviously it's going to estimate your shipping but over here it lets you know that your expected ship date is this date which which is the date that I actually set. So all I need to do is just to basically go back in the back end and just set up my product properly because as you can see it's not the same size as the other boxes but everything is working really really well and that is basically the pre-order app that I'm using which is really like simple to set up and what I like about this app is that it just looks like Shopify and it functions like Shopify. It's not opening up in a different window it's all within Shopify which I think is a major key when it comes to some of these apps so that is pretty much the early bird pre-order and in stock app really really simple and easy to set up so I really do like the app and as you can see it all like goes quite nicely with my website and the theme that I use already I am gonna go back switch up that picture add a little bit more of a description and actually see whether I can push a pre-order product and see how well that does for me but guys thank you so so much for watching this video and thank you to early bird for working with me on this video i'm going to have the link to the app in my description so that you can check it out try it out for yourselves and get those pre-order launch campaigns going thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like this video and i will catch you in my very next video bye